Yo, what's going on, people? Welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. I'm MC Bro, and it's been two weeks, but I'm back with the daily uploads. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys the most recent card implication glitch in GE5 Online after the 1.6. One patch. Um, the first thing you guys will need to do is spawn in your bunker. That's the most important thing. If you guys do not spawn in your bunker, doesn't matter which bunker you have, it will not work. The other requirement: you guys will need a Fagio and a uh, Fagio or Sanchez. So in the back of your MOC, you guys will need a MC clubhouse with an MC garage, and in that garage, you guys will need a man, a man uh, Sanchez and or a Fagio, and you guys will also need a Fagio in any one of your apartment garages, and then you guys will also need the Kayo duplicate. That was a lot in 30, 30 odd seconds, but I'll be showing you guys exactly how to do this glitch. Um, I am voiceover because I lost the um, audio footage, but I'll put the requirements at text on the start of the screen. Basically, what you guys will need to do is simply go ahead and call out your Fagio. That's the first thing you guys will need to do, but do not call it from your uh, MC Clubhouse. You guys will need to call this Fagio from any one of your um, apartments or we other garages in the city. But do not around. call it from your MC Clubhouse. As you can I'll see, I got mine from Del Perro Heights. Now all I'm going to do is put the spawn in and drive it into my bunker, simple as. Nothing too extreme so far, all I'm going to do is drive it in my bunker um, and then I'm going to put it in the back of my MOC. But I'm going to get an alert because as I told you already, you guys have to have it on another vehicle um, which is a Fagio or a Sanchez in your MOC at this time. So go ahead and hit my D-pad, accept the alert and that will put this Fagio into your MOC, simple as. Once you guys are in the MOC, simply get off the vehicle and exit the MOC on foot. Now what you want to do from here? is exit the bunker on foot and then you guys will be calling out the car you want to duplicate so i'm going to be showing you guys this is very important watch what i do so i'm going to exit i'm going to call my mechanic and i'm going to go ahead and call out my future sock issy all right that's the car i'm going to be duplicating i recommend a uh, fully upgraded future sock issy because it sells for the most money but the other vehicles you guys will be duplicating won't sell for a lot at all okay so i'm going to head and call that out for my um eclipse towers Okay, that's from Eclipse Towers, it's in the first lot, Future Shock Issy, that's the only one I have on my account. I'm going to be duplicating one, I'll be showing you proof at the end of the video. So wait for, wait for my timer to go down and call it in, no cuts, and basically I'm going to drive this into, the, into my bunker. Okay, so the video is going to be sped up just to make this a lot shorter video, because it was like 15 minutes long. But I did lose the audio footage, so I'm voiceovering it at the moment. So go ahead and get in the vehicle you want to duplicate, like I said, recommended a fully upgraded Benny's um, or Arena War vehicle. Any other vehicle won't sell for a lot of money at all, so don't go complaining in my comments. But if you guys have any issues with this glitch, please do comment down below. Anyway, once you guys have drove your car into your bunker, you guys need to drive it over to this wall near the MOC where this pipe is. And make sure you guys can get this alert, press my T-pad to store on your vehicle. Make sure you guys have that alert, if you don't then you need to position it better. And once you guys have that alert, simply go ahead and exit your Kion duplicate and just go ahead and exit the bunker. But that is important. Drive that vehicle you guys do want to duplicate when it's in your bunker to that wall, park it. Make sure you guys have that alert. If you don't, then you're doing it wrong. But if you do, great. Exit the bunker on foot. And then this is where you guys will need to go to your MC Clubhouse. Um, I recommend using a buzzard a C from a CEO, a sparrow from your Kosaka, or a job teleport glitch. But you guys cannot use a personal vehicle at all or it'll mess up the glitch, so don't call that one. Simply, the video is up from here. I'm simply flying over to my MC Clubhouse and my Sparrow that I caught from my submarine. Easy, easy done. Um, and all I'm going to do is go ahead and go up to my MC Clubhouse. So there's no cuts in this video. Um, it's all sped up footage, um, but it is working. i um, doing this at um, approximately 12.42 um, 12 p.m. in the UK time. Um, but once you guys are in the MC Clubhouse, simply enter on foot. And you guys will need to hop onto your Fagio or Sanchez. It doesn't matter, but it has to be either one of those motorbikes. And once you guys are in it, click right on the D-pad to modify your vehicle. Because like I said earlier, you guys will need an MC Clubhouse with the vehicle workshop. If you guys don't have it, you guys need to purchase it. Just simply change one thing on the vehicle. It's going to be brakes, armor, whatever, color, plate. Just change it and back out. That's all you need to do. Change it, back out, and then go off the Fagio or the Sanchez that you're on and simply exit your MC Clubhouse on foot. If you guys are having trouble following this video because I am going quite fast, simply comment down below and I can help. But this is working and I had to do this to keep the video as short as, po short as possible. Anyway, from here what you guys will need to do is get back into your helicopter or jump teleport back to your bunker. So I'm going to get in my helicopter, the video is sped up from here again. And I'm going to basically go back to my bunker because the glitch is literally almost done. It's so easy this glitch. The only problem which might take a while is because you guys will have to fly from the bunker to the MC Clubhouse twice back there, back forth, you know, it's just a little bit of trouble, but if you guys have them close to each other, more efficient, more easy duplication. Simply enter the bunker on foot, just like this, and on foot, there was no cuts there, just sped up footage, and then all I'm going to do is get into that issue, it should be where I parked it in the exact same spot, the exact same spot. 
you can see it's in this exact same spot against that pipe on the wall and all I'm going to do if you guys can see you can't see my plate because I've got armor on fully upgraded but my plate will be something and then when I get in the vehicle it'll change to a different plate okay that means it's clean all right it's a clean tube so all I'm going to do is hit right d-pad and accept the alert and put it in the MOC but you guys there's no proof that the plate changes but if you guys have it so you can see a plate you guys will see that it changes or it trust me it does it's 100% legit this glitch anyway once you guys get popped in the back of your MOC, just like that, that is the, the glitch done. The duplicated version is the one in your MOC that I'm like looking at right now. And the original is back in the garage I called it out of. And I'll be showing you proof of that. But if you guys want to rinse and repeat, you have to take this vehicle here. And you have to drive it out and put it into another another garage, okay? It can't be an empty clubhouse and it can't be a bunker. It has to be another garage. And I'll put it in my facility in the footage I'm showing you right now. But if you guys want to rinse and repeat you have to take this duplicated vehicle drive it out of your bunker and put it into the garage you guys will then need to put a fagio in the mrc uh, make sure you guys are stocked up with fagios um at your mc clubhouse uh, make sure you guys obviously have a car you want to duplicate and put another fagio you know, if you already have them put them in your apartment um that i called out earlier on with from del Perro. now all i'm doing here is the video is, is once again sped up to make it shorter but i'm driving this duplicated copy to my facility where i'll park it just like that simple as and then i put up my phone call the mechanic and i'll be showing you because early in the video where did i call my future truck issue from my original one eclipse towers suite three so my eclipse towers um that's where i called my future truck issue from the one that i've been, been duplicating and it's going to be there the original copy of it okay and the duplicated is the one i'm literally driving right now this is how easy the glitch is right take advantage before rockstar patches it all right there's lots of creators put, putting this video out but this is the first one i've ever done so i really hope it's helpful for you all if it's not please drop a comment down below on what i can, can improve and if you want me to slow down during my tutorials but um i'd say i could follow through this but if you guys can't please drop a comment down below feel free to I'll attend to it and assist you the best way I can because I do do duplications a lot. But once you guys um, have done the glitch, you guys can rinse and repeat by putting, um, what's it called, your duplicate copy in a different garage and repeating all those steps. But he's the, he's the moment of truth. What do you want? What up, my Penthouse Street? There, boom, original. That's the original. First slot, like I said earlier in the video, first slot, feature stock is he. And then if I go to um, my penthouse, my penthouse, my facility, there's the other one, two. That's the duplicated copy, it will sell for 1.7 million. I'm MP Bro, like, subscribe, turn the bell notification and comment down below. Road to 2K, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.